Hi guys, it's RR250. Welcome back to the channel for this week's daily basis review on Gran Turismo 7, where I give my take of the daily basis each week and let you know how I got on. So this week, a bit of a shorter daily basis review, having had a couple of days away during the week. But as ever, here we are with what we got up to. Daily Base A was at Lago Maggiore on the East End Reverse in the Group B cars for 8 laps on the Comfort Soft Tyre, 1 times Fuel, 1 times Tyre and BOP. A fun Group B rally race with lots going on. A fun track for the Group Bs with the Comfort Soft Tyre keeping you in check. And on the whole, great fun close racing. Although, pretty manic at times. The key, being able to control the mega horsepower under your right foot and get round the corners without turning into anybody. Daily Base 8 this week on Lago Maggiore East End Reverse. A nice change and a nice fun bit of rallycross. Something a bit more aggressive and we'll see if it comes up again in the future. Meanwhile, Daily Base B was at Trail Mountain in the Group 3 cars for four laps on the racing hard tyre, one times fuel, one times tyre and BOP. And more great Group 3 racing with pretty tough racing across the week, but got it round and got it done. Going up against some very highly rated drivers indeed. But with car setups back in the fold, tweaking things as we needed, we were able to, for the most part anyway, stay in the fight and not do so bad. With great battles all round, pushing on in the Nissan GT on Nismo, aka the RL250 mobile, getting it done. Daily base B this week on Trail Mountain. On the whole, great racing. Despite my pedals falling apart at the end of the week, nothing too bad though, all good in the end, and all part of the fun. And Daily Base C was at Brands Hatch in the Group 4 cars for 11 laps on the racing medium tyre, 1 times fuel, 5 times tyre, and BOP. And enjoyed getting to grips with the Renault Megane Trophy. In a fun race where pit stop strategy played its part, changing tyres if you thought that was best. Other than that, foot to the floor and great racing. Running on Brands Hatch, a track that can take a while to get warmed up, but once we do, all good and enjoyed it. Daily race speed this week on Brands Hatch, a good race with strategy, tyres, battles and the like. The Renault Megane Trophy, turns out it's pretty quick. So here are this week's daily races from my worst to best. So this week, my worst daily race is Daily Base A and Daily Base C. And this week, my favourite daily race on Gran Turismo 7 is Daily Base B. Daily races A and C, not much to separate them. The Group B rally cross fun, countered by the fun racing on Brands Hatch. But this week, Trial Mountain and Daily Base B was where most of our time was spent. Racing well and racing hard. Another race with car setups, as was also the case in Daily Base C as well. And using the right one was able to give you the edge. Pushing on and getting it done. And so for that, Daily Base B is, once again, our favourite daily race this week. And do let me know what you thought of the daily races this week in the comments down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the brand new daily races on Gran Turismo 7 next week. Thanks for watching. Bye.